In answer to the question, what is software-defined networking, I give a very simple answer. It's empowerment. It's the opportunity to be able to take control of the networking resources that you need to get the packets that your application is designed to process. It is an opportunity that's not been available before because previously network elements have required some esoteric commands to be entered through a command line interface, prone to error, done by humans, and not done in real time. Software-defined networking has taken the opportunity to present an API consistent across the industry that people can write applications to and configure networks on the fly to respond to developing needs in real time. By separating the forwarding plane elements from the control plane, application developers can concentrate on what they do best, which is understanding how to manage traffic flows, while vendors like Redisys can build the forwarding elements that perform high throughput, low latency packet handling to get the packets to where they need to be in response to the rules which are being created through protocols like OpenFlow that allow the application to define the network characteristics it needs. This split between forwarding plane and control plane has not previously been available in the network appliance space. It's something we're used to in the carrier networks and in the mobile phone networks, but actually within the building blocks that build up your local area network, it's something which is completely new. Radius has built products to leverage this opportunity, and we would like to have a dialogue with our customers. Let's work together. <laughs>